that we have talked about what is the meaning of manufacturing industries and in what way it was it would provide our nation for an exchange currency or how it, it is important for development of a nation right next we talked about uh, which place is suitable for locating an industry what are the various factors that are involved in deciding that whether we should establish our industry okay now we will classify various kind of industries first one is agro based now in this agro based category there is sub category which is textile industry right textile industry very important why we have two points for that that is because <coughs> it gives a significant contribution in economy in building economy of india not only it provides uh, employment but it also provides good revenue why that we are going to talk about first thing is industrial production right whatever industries which has been set up in india out of that 14% contributes to textile right means 14% is 14% uh, production comes from textile industry second employment generation it gives employment to almost 35 million people right so again very important <coughs> now if we talk in terms of gdp gdp is basically gross domestic product which is as i have already told you before that it is a value which shows how fast an economy is growing so 4% of the total gdp is comes from textile industry right very important point last one why i said that textile industry is very important lies in this point this industry is self reliant self reliant means right from the raw material to the finished product okay right from the raw material to the finished product we have all the resources available and we don't need any kind of help from any other country in this regard we can grow cotton right for example we can grow cotton and we can we are we have sufficient technology to make a finished product from cotton right so <clears throat> okay moving on to cotton textile cotton textile in ancient time it was used by using uh, cotton was weaved by using hand spinning and hand looms right you may have seen a uh, picture of mahatma gandhi using charkha so that is hand spinning means mechanical work was done by human beings right another point is in the pre independence era it was difficult for us to trade because whatever we were growing in our land britishers were taking it away and using it using it using that on their own in their own mills and they what they used to do is they used to bring back that finished product and sell in indian markets right so this was very difficult <coughs> okay last point initially cotton industries were concentrated in maharashtra and gujarat due to initially when we started this is basically after means the post independence era when we were done done with britishers we established our cotton textile industries in maharashtra and gujarat so there were few reasons why these got uh, textile industry went well in these regions first is raw cotton market raw cotton was available at this point right it uh, means uh, already we have talked about that cotton grows well in these parts of our country so it is quite easily available next thing is transportation transportation now maharashtra and gujarat both provide seaport so it was easier to access seaports for exporting our raw uh, our finished product in other countries third thing is cheap labor cheap labor was available here and finally we have moist climate 